Hey, it's your boy, Mr. Smith from the band Houseplant, and welcome to the first official Houseplant Wheels of Scream stream rated TV14. So I'd like to start every single stream with a reading from the Spooky Monkey Wand, otherwise known as the Spooky Gospel. So please, a moment of silence. The first is the worst, except when it's not. The first is enough to boil the pot. The first is enough to show that you care, to prove that the spooky energy truly is there. Let's head on over to the wheels and see what we're gonna be doing for today. We have our instrument wheel. See what instrument we're gonna use. All right, big instruments only. Now the pedal wheel we spin four times. Let's try this out. Oh, nice. Okay, so we have the Korg Toneworks Overdrive second pedal. Here we go. Okay. All right, so that is the Sound Tank Phaser. We're using the CE5 two weeks in a row. All right, our fourth pedal today is going to be the RT20. So we've got our category, we've got our pedals. I have got everything set up for us. We have an instrument, a big instrument over here. We've got the Yamaha PSS 680. This is one of my favorite Yamaha Porta sounds. Big shout out to Zeb for telling me about it. I got this bad boy for $60 and I have the box as well. Now this little doodah right here, this is a two operator FM synthesizer. Plus it has playable drums. Good job, Yamaha. Good job. Keep up the good work. Uh, we believe in you. That's like a fast strut. Let's start with our drums. We're gonna put that drive up a little bit. Cool, let's build in a part B to this. Cool, so we'll do four bars here and we'll do four bars now. That snare by itself is weak sauce. So let's double it up. That one. There's all kinds of other sounds in here as well. Ah, gong gong qui. Let's add a gong gong qui to part B. Rule, if you're watching this and you're under 14, turn it off. This is not for you. This is 14 and over only. It's in the freaking name. So let's do shakers now. Part B. Claps, rated G. We're going to utilize the two operator FM synthesizer here. Part B. Try Koto. Up next, I got the big Bertha of big instruments, the Moog Matriarch. USA, 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 USA. We're gonna use this bad boy to make a bass line, so let's do it. Let's make it going up, up the octave, and then sync it. We got that set. Let's use our cutoff. Little bit of glide. Oh, 
Oh, Zeb, uh, you're on. Let's field it up. Yeah. Uh, name this beat. Fields of Screed. <laughs> Let's make some freaking dang ear candy, shall we? This has a really amazing delay built into it. Then we're going to use that. Doing some higher octave stuff. Let's put all these down. Next one we're going to use is the ESQ-1. Oh my god, everything is getting tangled up on everything. I'm hitting my head on my fucking microphone. It's a mess. Cool. And let's do one of those music box things for part B as well. Let's actually go to our last instrument of the day, which will be the Juno X. Cool. Let's keep going in our Juno sound. We are now in the part of the stream where we have to start arranging this bam boy. So here's how we do it. Here's a time lapse of me arranging all the bullshit we just did. And here's the final product, Fields of Screed. Big shout out to Garth Tim for naming it. Hope you enjoy, like, comment, subscribe. <laughs>